Hello everyone. In the last tutorial, we discussed how to sync Dreamweaver and get it to set up t with your website. We also created a sample index, which is the first page users will see when they come to your website. In this tutorial, I would like to elaborate more on the index and show you a way of building the index in its entirety. Um, now, the way I'm building it this time will be using a method called tables. Um, but I'm going to get started and you'll see what that is in a moment. So I'm going to select our old index here and I'm just going to delete it. And then I'm going to go to file, new, HTML, and none. I'm just going to hit create. Okay, and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to change the title from Untitled Document to Home. And now this will appear on the main title of the tabs of Mozilla Firefox or Google Chrome or whatever you use. Um, also, I'm going to come to Page Properties and I'm just going to change the background. Okay, now the table way is where you insert tables and then the tables hold whatever content you have such as pictures, videos, text, stuff like that. Um, so I'm going to go to insert table. I'm going to make it one row, two columns, 1040 or 1024 in width. And this is the standard um, desktop size for websites. And make sure there's no uh, border and uh, leave these blank. I'm just going to hit OK. Now, so the user sees it centered on their screen, I'm just going to go to Align and Center. And now this has been centered on their screen. Um, so now. I'm going to add a picture. So I'm just going to go to insert image just to show that this can insert a picture. And I'm going to go to my desktop. And we're just going to go to my other website and borrow this. It's just wanting me to save a copy to this website. Just hit OK. And there's my logo. Now usually what most logos do is they link directly to your home page. Now you don't see uh, index.html here and that's because it hasn't been saved. So I'm going to come to file save as I'm going to save it as index with a lowercase i hit save and you'll see it appear right here now and you'll also see this up here change to index don't worry about any of this other stuff it's all from my other website okay so I'm going to drag this link here to the index now this isn't very helpful because it's on the index but you never know there may be someone that clicks it anyway um, You've also will notice that this bar is pushed way out here now. Um, if you want content beside your logo, you can just drag this over here and I'm just gonna put a little bit of text in here. Okay. You can also uh, center this to make it perfectly centered with the lo this line and this line. So now we have content held in by a table. And you may be wondering, you put no border, but you have this dotted line. Well, if you would go and look at this in its live form, there's nothing here. 
So you don't actually see the table, you just see the contents of the table. Okay, so we want to add another table, you know, we want more to it. Um, so make sure that this table right here isn't clicked. You want the bar to be right after the table, and then you do the same thing you did before, just go to insert table, and just center this table. And here you can make it um, one column, or even three, four, however many makes sense to you. And if you know, if you have a blog, website, or something, um, this would be the place for that. put some sample code there. Okay, so now we have our sample code in the middle, we have two tables, and we have a picture that links to the own index, so it will reload the page. So, say the, our last table we may want, I don't know, like a copyright. Um, so we'll go to insert table, Come down here and make it one column once again. And here you can just type, you can type copyright or uh, Dreamweaver has. special characters you go to insert HTML special characters and just click the copyright and you'll see the little circle with the C inside it and just put you know whatever is your company name and I'll just center this so right now we've successfully created our index just save all and you can keep doing this you know you can put more pictures here this will get you started with all the text um, you know and then your footer here and you can move these tables up and down between each other um, everything like that um, tables are good for tabular data or if you're doing a basic website However, in the next tutorial, I will show you how to create the exact same thing on here, only with div tags. And div tags are usually what most people use now, but I'm just going to show you both ways of doing it. Also, styling, uh, navigation bars, all of that is coming in a future tutorial. So if you like the videos or want to see the future tutorials, please subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.